Before we get started, I'd just like to say a massive thank you to the awesome people at Warner Brothers Games for providing me with an early copy of LEGO DC Super Villains. Also guys, I must further add that through the next few episodes there will be no audio from the gameplay. The reason because of that is because for some ridiculous reason my capture card was only recording my commentary from my microphone. It wasn't actually recording the gameplay. I have no idea why it did this, but I really do apologize. But hopefully you can still find some enjoyment in these next few episodes. But of course, I will make sure that doesn't happen again after these episodes have been uploaded. All right, Clarkson, you may be new, but I like you, and I'm a great judge of character, so I want you covering the Star Labs break-in. Sure thing, oh. Perry. Aw, oh, don't look so gloomy, Lois. I'm sending you to the Galaxy Communications uh. Tower Gala. It's gonna be a glamorous event. You'll get to interview VIPs about their designer dresses, that sort of thing. Ah. Uh. Mm. Ah. Uh. Huh? Ha! Aw. Oh. Uh. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. White, I know it sounds crazy, but the Justice Syndicate are big-time villains. You have got to believe me. And stay up. He didn't believe me. No evidence, no story. You mind if we talk? <clears throat> if what you're saying is true, this would be incredible. So, you believe us? Sure I do, but the public's not going to accept your story without any evidence or even an eyewitness to back it up. Well, Harley Quinn saw them wipe out the whole of the Justice League. No kidding. We should get her for an interview. First, we have to find her. Then get to it. Because it'd be criminal not to expose the Justice Syndicate for who they Whoa. really are, right? Okay, so we need to find Harley Quinn fast. I know a few of her secret hideouts, so I'll check on those. Meanwhile, you guys make your way to Bell Rev and see if her Task Force X buddies know anything about where she is. What's going on, everybody? It's Game Unboxing Reviews here, and welcome back to my LEGO DC Supervillains walkthrough. So right now, we're of course going to be playing as Killer Frost and my custom character, Plastic Beard. So without further ado, let's get to it. Alright, let's head down these steps and move on into the next mission, which... Before, the, you know, in the last video, I didn't actually have a vehicle. Oh yeah, I forgot. We can grow really big now. But if I press square and we get a vehicle real quick... Uh, what should we choose? Just something quick. I'll tell you what, I do want to try that. Let's have a go at that one. There we go. See what this vehicle's like, shall we? Off we go! Left, 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 left! <laughs> I like this area, it's really spooky. Oh, okay, I guess we're going up here now. GCPD. Ah, so we actually have to... Can we just jump over? No. Seems like we have to get over properly. How do we do that? How do I get over there properly? I think I might have went the wrong way. Hang on. Do we have any flying characters yet? Anyone that can fly? Uh, I don't think I've got any that can fly. Well, that's annoying. Hang on a sec. I have an idea. Excuse me, pardon me. Alright. If we go back down here, there might be another way up. If we're lucky. What's that? Is that useful by any chance? I don't think it is. Just keep running over here. Like this. There's a ladder here. Maybe that'll take us to it. I like how quickly they climb the ladders now. Here we are. Nice. We are accepting no visitors today. Or any day for that matter. We are on a soft touch like it's strikers. Oh, no. We run a tight ship. But not a ship. Like, like a boat or whatever. <laughs> See ya. I'll bring you back something French. 
Don't nobody steal nothing from my cell while I'm gone, you hear? <laughs> He's breaking out. This is the third time today. Yeah, which button activates the lasers? All right, quickly build. Come on, plastic beard. There we go. Oh, that's cool. That's pretty awesome. Like a good fit for my icy talents. There we go. And then, is there another one? Oh, no, never mind. We did it. Sweet. All right, let's jump into the pipe. This is Amanda Wong. Whoa, we're in Bell Rev. That's pretty cool. Your escapades at Strikers Island, but rest assured, you will not be leaving this place anytime soon. Deadshot. Captain Boomerang. Amanda Waller, of course, on the top left. Or above us right now. There we are. Let's destroy this gold Lego object so we can get through. Nice. Smash. Smash. Oh, wait, what? Oh, there we go. I was wondering why that wasn't working. It's because I wasn't close enough. Hey, do you mind? I'm kind of busy here. All right, let's get building. There we go. Push this button. Take out these guards. All right. Oh, I guess that's Waller gone. All right. So I'm guessing we're going to be uh, recruiting Deadshot and Captain Boomerang in a little bit. Can we do that? Oh, nice. They kept the shrinking thing from Lego Marvel 2. That's cool. Uh, make your way through the maze and hit the control switch. You may need to rotate the maze to open up new paths. Okay. How do we get rid of the spark? Oh, I guess it works when... Oh, man. That was close. I guess it works when... Haha! -ha! Have I gone the right way? I think I have. Yep, there we go. Jump off. And there we go. Nice. Whoa! Being able to shrink is very useful. <laughs> Dead shot. Nice. And Captain Boomerang. Anyone else? Killer Frost. Obviously, we got her already. But we got Captain Boomerang. That's cool. And Dead Shot. I want to see what he can do. Hold down circle. What does he do? Very cool. Okay, so that, that's kind of similar to Two Face, but that still looked awesome. Oh, I like his uh, guns sound different to everyone else's. That's nice. Nice little uh, bit of detail there. Attention to detail. Alright, what's this? Oh, cool! He's got like a sniper rifle. Or an assault rifle. Oh, there's a character token in there. I wonder if we can get it. Probably not at the moment. Off we go into the next mission, I think. Oh, okay, maybe not. <laughs> I thought that would lead into the next mission. How wrong I was. Take that. Hey, come on now. That's it? Nice. Okay, can we get out now? Sorry, I gotta move. Oh, that's how you look at the text and things. I just deleted that text. Oh well. I didn't mean to, but it um, probably wasn't that important. going to the Gotham Botanical Garden. Maybe she's taking that horticulture as a hobby or something. Botanical Gardens. Horticulture. Just lead the way. Okay, how are we gonna get across there? Never mind, I found a way. We'll get a boat! That works, right? 
Yeah, we'll get a boat. We hold down triangle, press square, and we can get ourselves a nice speedboat. There we are. Cool. Was there water vehicles in Lego Marvel 2? I can't remember. Well, I don't think there was. Am I mistaken? Because I feel like there wasn't. I'm glad to see them return in this one, though. It's just nice to have the option to be able to drive them, you know? Here we are. Quick way of getting across. I love that we can access vehicles like that now. and We don't have to go to some sort of platform or anything. That's really, really handy. Tap circle. Continue story. Yes. Hey, Lois. Shouldn't we be heading over to the Metropolis Gala? Don't worry, Jimmy. Expensive dresses and canapes can wait. Didn't Mr. White put Clark... I, I, I mean... Kent Clarkson on this job? He did, but it's gonna take the planet's best reporter to uncover how the Justice Syndicate let two villains slip through their fingers at Star Labs. Call me suspicious, but there's something not quite right about those Justice League replacements. I mean, one of them's called Deathstorm. What kind of a hero name is that? Once we're done, we'll go to the gala. Oh, great! I don't want to miss those canopies. <sighs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, let's take down Poison Ivy. But first, let's collect some studs, because that's what we do. <laughs> but obviously, what we could do with Captain Boomerang here is cut these vines. Or maybe not. Okay. Ivy didn't really uh, appreciate that before anyway, so she probably made the vines stronger. Alright. Deadshot's really cool in this game. I like the way they've done them. Can we shoot it? Are we supposed to be shooting it? Oh, we are supposed to be shooting it. Okay, cool. Ah, now we're fighting, like, plants or, or mushrooms or something. What's that? I'm guessing we have to destroy it. Boom. Alright, let's destroy it. Oh, okay. <laughs> X, 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 X. Press X, press X. There we go. That should blow that up. There we go. Nice, Nicely done, Captain Boomerang. Smash this. Boom. Awesome. Oh, now we can get past there, but wait a minute. We need a character with detective skills. Detective mode. Oh, Deadshot has it. Great. That's useful. Hang on, let me just take care of these mushroom henchmen. Hang on. There we go. Did it. Finally. <laughs> Let's smash this. There we go. That should do it.
Hang on, let me smash these things. Oh, okay, I guess we gotta run. Hey, there's my custom character. He wasn't there before, was he? And he's got his flaming fists now. Plastic Beard has his flaming fists. Awesome. He didn't have them before for some reason. Nice to see them back. Alright. Let's smash these things. Boom. Right, let's uh, head on over here. There we go. Collect them studs. Right, what are we doing now? Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, Killer Frost, my bad. Um, I'm gonna guess we have to rescue Deadshot, but how? Just smash things? No. Where's Boomerang gone? We can't go back up into the woodlands. Yeah. Oh, there he is. There's Boomerang. He's stuck. Oh, I see. We've got to um, we've got to fight uh, Poison Ivy. I think, or maybe not. I don't even know. There we go. That that's working. I don't know if you're supposed to go up there and do it, but it's working at least. I think. Ow. Yeah, nice. <laughs> Poison Ivy's worst enemy. <laughs> Gardening gloves. Alright. No, actually, no. Uh, Poison Ivy's... Uh, Worst enemy would probably be um, the you know the things you cut with what they called. <laughs> I'm drawing a blank for some reason. You know what I mean? Like shredders or whatever you call them. Right. Take that, crocodile man! Nice. Press if you need help. I don't think we need help. We just gotta freeze this now, I'd imagine. Yep. There we are. Whoa! That's cool. Nicely done, Killer Frost. Very nicely done indeed. Oh, uh, she's struggling to run. Come on, Plastic Beard. <laughs> hey, why is his uh, eye patch purple? Kind of weird. Oh, let's destroy this. Can we destroy it? No, we can't. Okay. Why have all my abilities turned pink? What happened to my powers? They're all pink. That's very bizarre. Has Ivy done that? No, you need to shoot at her. There you go. It's not working. Now it is. Oh, we're going to get a new power. Cool. Let's go, Plastic Beard. Ah! Massive plant trying to eat me. There we go. What are we going to get this time? I wonder. Come on. Oh, come on. Don't do that. Thank you. Here we go. What is it? 
New ability unlocked. Super strength. Ah, cool. So now we're a super strength plast uh, plastic beard. <laughs> that's awesome because that's what I wanted anyway for this kind of character. Super strength. Awesome. Alright. Let's build this up. And pick it up and throw it at this crack in the wall, I would imagine. Alright, let's get building. Oh, okay, so... Deadshot, where are you at? You can come back in your, here in free play? What? No, we need Deadshot. How do I get Deadshot over there? Let's smash this to start off with. Come on, Plastic Beard. I keep nearly saying Plastic Man. Like That's what I keep thinking in my head, Plastic Man. Um, it's Plastic Beard. That's my character's name. He's not a ripoff of Plastic Man. <laughs> Even though I can't wait to play as Plastic Man, I think he's in the game. I hope he is, because he's always one of my favourite characters to play as. Because I just love the flexible characters. I love seeing what TT games let them transform into this time. I mean, it's it's always great to see. Alright. Fire! There we are. Seriously, what is up with my character? Why is his eye patch and everything pink all of a sudden? And his powers are pink. I'm so confused. It's like he's been poisoned or, or something. Or maybe it has nothing to do with that. Come on, Ivy, that's enough. <laughs> Sheila. <laughs> <laughs> Plastic beard. That is a pretty cool name. <laughs> Talk to Dylan, don't, don't say much. <laughs> oh wow that guy's on the, you see that <laughs> the guy hanging there that was hilarious <laughs> i love captain boomerang in this game they've made him so funny so funny i just can't stop laughing at everything he says Hey, my powers are back to normal now. That's good. Who do we get players now that we haven't played as? Ivy! I want to see what Ivy can do. I've been looking forward to playing as her. So, hold circle. What does that do? I'm spinning around. <laughs> okay. She attacks with her vines. Oh, that is awesome. Hey, you know what would be cool if in, like, um... The future, like, if we ever get a LEGO Marvel 3, if they make symbiotes, like, Venom and Carnage kind of fight like that, so that's, like, their tendrils coming out of them, that would be amazing. I'd love that. That would really make their combat more um, exciting and different. 
I think that's all she can do for now, I think. Whoa! Bad idea. Bad idea. Alright, um... Ivy... No, wait, hang on. Who do we need to get across here, I wonder? Is it Ivy? Can't be Ivy, because she can't really do anything at the moment. Interesting. Interesting. Let's go over here. Oh, hang on. There's something down here. Oh, is it just studs? I think it's just studs. Can we smash this wall? Yeah, of course I can. I've got super strength now. Nice. Right, now we need a character that can go through that vent, it seems. Oh, wait, we can, because we can shrink. I keep forgetting how many abilities this guy has. Plastic Beard is, like, super powerful already. He's getting so powerful, it's getting to the point where maybe wearing, like, civilian clothes is just, you know, maybe he should have a costume by now. Smash. Aw. Okay. Let's hop in here. Like this. Right. Okay. Wait. Where am I? Oh, there he is. Okay, he's right at the bottom. So, we need to get to the other side. All right. I've got this. Ow, 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 ow. There we are. Almost there. Nice one. Easy peasy. That should shut that off. Awesome. Alright, let's keep moving. Where? Oh, the police are going to attack us. Let them try. Where are they? Where's the police? I don't see them. Oh, there. Hello, police. Bye-bye, police. <laughs> Plastic beard smash! I love how you can grow big and everything. That's just so awesome. Hey! How do I uh, get them... Attack them when they've got a shield? That's what I'm trying to work out. Maybe while well, Deadshot's got them occupied? No? Okay. Interesting. So, oh, do you have to let them charge and then... Yeah, there we go. Now we can do it. Nice! Why can't we smash these flowers? Maybe Ivy won't let us. <laughs> Makes sense, I guess. Ah. So now we need Deadshot? Can he turn invisible? Wait. Why would Deadshot be able to get past those cameras? That's interesting. I want to see how this works. Ah, he can turn invisible. That's cool. I didn't realize he could do that. Obviously, it'll be to do with some tech or something. Invisible tech. Take that, officers! I'm sorry. This game is all about the villains, so I have to attack you. Whoa. Hey, stay down. Oh, I can smash this flower bed, though. Oh, well, maybe not. <laughs> I can hit it, but I can't fully destroy it. Hey, I'm going to drop you off the edge. Oh! <laughs> if I'm going, you are too. <laughs> that just got very dark. Okay. Whoa! Didn't mean to do that. Nice. Boom. There we are. Let's get building. What's this we're building? Oh, it's for Harley's hammer. Yep. I got you. I got you. Nice one. Climb, Harley, climb. Alright, off we go. 
Oh, by the way, Harley has some really cool abilities in this game. Like, um, if you hold down, I think, circle, she gets out a, uh, like a, um, a speaker and, um, a boombox, sorry. Yeah, boombox. And sh she, uh, basically plays some music, but it's like real music. Like, she'll start playing Hit Me With Your Best Shot. And it's, and it's just awesome because she starts skating around and dancing to it. And it's just really cool. Really, really cool little feature. Only thing I wish is that you could attack while you're doing it, but it's mainly just for walking. Well, she, she's like, she's just skating casually, basically. But still, it's a really cool feature. I love it. I hope there's more characters that can do that in the game because it's just fun. Like other variations of it rather than just another boombox. Oh, a UFO! Oh, now it's moving. That's creepy. <laughs> I need to catch up on next week's, last week's episode. Oh, there's a purple stud in there. Give me that. Yes! True villain! Nice. I already bought a few characters in the open world, and I haven't got many studs left, so... You know, getting all the studs in these missions does help quite a bit. The, the characters are quite expensive, actually. Most of them are like 250,000. Um, some of them are cheap, though. I think uh, Roy Harper was like, you know, Arsenal. I think he was like 10,000, I think. So some of them are super cheap, but it really depends. And it varies like quite a bit. You would think some of them would be cheap and then they're actually expensive and then um, vice versa as well. So some of them... It's, 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 yeah, you've got a, is that Mike from Monsters, Inc.? <laughs> it kind of looks like him with the one eye. That's creepy. What's this? Ah, dead shot. Sneaky, sneaky. Doing some investigative work. There we are. Oh, wait, of course we need Ivy. Ah, right, so this is going to be like Scarecrow's thing where he made the fear toxin, but she's going to make like a big plant or something, I'd imagine. That's cool. Still a few things left to smash around here, so let's uh, have a look around. And of course, we've got to find the other flowers and whatnot. Ah, here we go. We can go inside here. And there's another piece for um, Ivy. Hop in here. Look at all those TV screens. There you go, Ivy. That should do it. Get down here. We can't destroy this. I think that's because... Um, oh, yeah, no, that's uh, that's the thing where you have to disguise yourself uh, with Clayface. So that might be for free play, I guess. Finally, I destroyed the UFO. Oh, wow, it, it, it ate me. What the heck? I was not expecting that. Nice surprise. It actually ate me. <laughs> it's eating me up. Alright. Do your thing, Ivy. Right, so what do we do here? Oh, we're gonna, um, confuse him. <laughs> All right, give me them studs. Are you ready, people? Let's move it. Plastic beard. Come on. You're making yourself look bad, plastic beard. Oh, wow. Look, they're all ready for us. Nicely done. Oh, I want to see what uh, Ivy's special move is. Oh, wow, look. Oh, wow, she, like, drags them into the ground. That's crazy. I think you have to press it twice as well, so you can kind of watch them getting uh, thrown around by uh, the vines and everything. That's a little bit different. Let me try that again just to make sure. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I won't try that again. Forget it. It's fine. <laughs> I don't want to die. 
Right. Whoa! Can you just let me smash this box real quick? Please? Alright, let's go through this vent. Because I can get really small. Haha! -ha. Who's the big man now? What's happening? Oh, I guess it's telling us to do that for Ivy. Hang on, Ivy. We've got to take care of the police first. <laughs> Is there no match for giant plastic beard? Every time I say it, plastic man's in my mind. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm almost going to say plastic man. I have to go, no, it's plastic beard. <laughs> plastic beard. And don't you forget it. Some of these tables I can't seem to smash, it seems. Imagine you're just having dinner and then this all this just happens. All of a sudden, this giant bearded man with uh, an eye patch um, or a monocle um, comes in and, and grows like massive and starts smashing everything while you're uh, eating your your dinner. While you're eating your meal. That would be pretty scary. <laughs> I think I would just leave. I'd be like, uh, uh, yeah, I, I, can I have the check, please? <laughs> is that a bat? Is that the bat symbol? Oh, uh, no, maybe not. I thought it was the bat signal. Hey, how come I can't fight him? Are you on our side or something? That's weird. Alright, where's Ivy at? Oh! Oh, Ivy, how did you get down there? Oh. Alright, come on, let's head on over here. Hold characters like Poison Ivy can use a hold circle. I'm not even going to attempt to say that. Chlorokinesis. Oh, okay, I did it quite good, actually. Oh, wow! That's cool. I like that. That's going to give us something, isn't it? Alright, that gave us some studs. But let's actually go the proper way now and see what happens. That's a cool... I really like how much detail has gone into the villains. That's one of the greatest things about this being villain-based. Is they get to put even more effort into the villains. Because they are the main playable characters. And that's just really, really cool. Whoa. Yes! Nice! Ladies and germs. Tch. <laughs> 